Well, if you check in there, that's a 45 single record in the oven at about 160 degrees uh, Celsius. See, I put a bowl there. I'm going to make a nice ashtray. Let me show you my other work. Here's my other work. See, I covered the holes with uh, putty. Not the best uh, looking record, but you know it's an ashtray. But let me show you the others. This I still have to fix, uh, cover the holes. But this is just my previous work, the shape and everything. See, I like to use these type of records because they only have like a small little hole that I can just uh, cover up. But yes. It is very nice. If you have single records, you hate single records like me. Uh, I use full size records. Single records is like two minutes long and it's over. Just remember to preheat your oven for about five to eight minutes. I'm going to take it out and just bend it in shape. I'm not sure where I'm going to put this camera. See, I've got another record, but it's just a big, big hole. I don't even think I could do anything with it. I think this was in my car, just for show. My old 78 bug. Um, let me put the camera somewhere and I'll take it out. I uh, just want to say, um, you see, I made these as well. Uh, out of the big ones. Now this is actually a beautiful shape. I did the same thing with the bowl. Same bowl. There's another one over there. One of the fruit bowls of ours. And another fruit bowl of ours. Okay, let's get it out. Whew. You shouldn't put it in too much because uh, melted vinyl is kind of toxic. Um, you must put it in at least five or, well, a single record like this will be five to seven minutes. But a bigger one will be to ten, from ten to fifteen minutes, depends on ho how hard the vinyl is, of course. a little too hot. Let me just grab, grab it quick and put it down. Ah. Oh. See? See how soft this is? That bends. Me put in shape. I'm not sure if you can see. I need to hurry because this thing actually draws super fast. I mean, not not dry, but cool, super fast. Ah, there we go. It's still a bit soft, but it is better. On this cold tile. It might actually cool it down this old this uh, cool platform of ours. Uh, a few seconds. Let's move it around. Kind of interesting, I didn't do this side for some reason, but it's, it actually looks very nice. Yeah, you can you see it's hot now. It's still hot, but um, yeah. At least someone can use it for an ashtray. One of the ashtrays. 
The thing is, when you put it in, it actually comes out so differently with different uh, shapes. You never know what you're going to get. Um, I can do this one as well, if you want to take a look. It's going to be a while though. Let me just uh, open the oven and stuff it in. This one I can't manage with the dot. There's a dot on the glass. Uh, so I know where to put the little dot, but this dot's so big. I mean, this uh, hole is so big. Okay. Oh, this it's something. It's weird that this uh, doesn't in, uh, bend. But the great thing is you can actually put it back in if you want and uh, reshape it. You know what? I think I'm going to do that. Let me take this LP out. Oh, boy. Never mind. It's starting to cook. I mean, I don't know how long that was. It was like in there for 20 seconds and I don't know if you can see it. But it's, uh, it's really warped. <laughs> but yeah, let me uh, just keep it in there a little longer. About a minute or so. I mean, it's. Let me turn it up to 170. You shouldn't actually do 170, but you know, I'm just doing it very quick because I know how. But um, you can put it uh, to 120, but it's going to just take longer for a big, thicker record to start to soften. I believe you can also soften the LP with hot water as well if you wish. Um, I don't want to oil my skin, so I will not do that. But also, you can, I believe you can soften the record and you can cut shapes out of it. You can use it for uh, the topics or whatever you want to make. I think it's, it's about done as it can be. I'm not sure if the camera is seated properly. Okay, let's get started. Oh, oh the smell is starting to, to burn, but not much. Let's see what happens if you're not lined up much, but uh, you can still shape it. It's just super hot, and I mean super hot, I mean, look how soft that is. Just blowing it. Okay, there we go. This is how it turned out. See, now these are nice because you can put your cigarettes on each side. With these, it's you can. But it's just too thin, but it will be nice in that uh, hitch over there, if I can say that. But I'll uh, put it back in and uh, re, uh, re, uh, call reform it. That's what I want to say. You know what? I'm going to put it like that. No, oh, I'm done. It, oh, that was. Hot. Okay, there it's lined up with that dot. I just made a permanent uh, mark. I took a permanent mark and just made that uh, dot. It's 
pretty carefully. Okay, I'm going to turn it down to 130. Okay. As you can see, it's in. Looks like it's uh, folding a bit. I'll bring it back when I take out the LP. Okay, I didn't put it in too much. I'm going to take it out right now. I just want to soften the, the material, the vinyl. I don't want it to get too hot. But I see it's starting to fall, the, fall back a bit. I'm going to actually test it quickly. Oh, there we go. That's, that's actually nice. See, I love working with uh, vinyl. So artistic. Make a little notch here. Hey, it looks like an arrow. <laughs> I'll show you guys now. I'm just bending it. Some places are still softer than others. But that should do. Uh, just lifting up the walls a bit. Not too much. You don't want to do it too much, of course. And there it is. See, I made it nicely. Made it uh, like an area, so it's, you can actually grip it nicely. Come on, autofocus. There we go. See, now I can just use putty just to fill up the hole with this. You see, I don't know what to do with this. I can put putty, but it's not going to look nice. But again, you know, if you want to uh, use putty, you can. Then you can use paint to paint the putty as well. Okay, well, I hope this helps. Please share, please subscribe. Enjoy if you are doing this. Enjoy the art.